All right, boys. Um, my camera setup is kind of like scuffed right now because I I reset my windows and I like move my PC slightly. Anyway, um, patch notes, bond patch notes. For fourth anniversary, LR Melly Yoda's. Wow, we were. Oh my god, that looks so good. That looks so good. That looks so sexy. That is that is sexy. All right. Anyway, <clears throat> so for LR, you'll need um. A hundred of these coins, which we can get, we get 60 on login, and then we can get 24 every week. So we'll get 60 now. Oh, on global, you'll get it mad late. That's so sad. But on JP, we'll get it 60 on login, and then this week we get 24, and on Sunday reset, we get 24 again. So on Sunday, I'll have his uh, LR. Uh, anyway, three super hyper books, which probably just like a bunch of, just takes a bunch of red books, and then six UR pendants. That's kind of crazy. That is kind of crazy. And they only decided to give us th uh, three SR pendants. So we'll see. This tab looks sick though. Now if you didn't see, when he's LR, I don't know if they show it. When he's LR, he is actually going to be um, a super awakened book, ain't no way. Uh, when he's LR, he has 75 KCC. And I'm not making that up, he has 75 KCC. Okay, well, let's talk about Bond though, hold on. Let's go to Bond. Let's hope this page loads, uh, you know. Um, Usually, uh, there's a very high chance everything crashes. Okay, so what they did is they had every every um, festival melee on the banner. So we have perg melee on the banner. We have perg melee on the banner. We have trader melee. We have assault melee. We have lost vein melee, which lost vein is the best one right here. All of these fronts, lost vein, high key the best one. Um, but high key I mean definitely because uh, 75 KCC, yikes. <clears throat> Red Tarmiel, green Tarmiel, huge, right? The old ones too, right? Brunhella, people still think she's good, so good that they put her on the banner so you can know that she, they can learn that she's not good. Green Eastern is gonna be huge, like I genuinely huge. Um, Sour Merlin, you know, for the, the people that don't like playing the game. The all oh, every unit here is actually good, like every unit is here, here is good or has value to your account, right? Um, now even Zanari, because people don't have her, like so many people don't have her, so that's huge. Um, banner, this, this is the, like if you. <sighs> I know a lot of you free to place, you know. I have to say it how it is. You, you stinky, stinky free to place. Not listening to our advice. You summoned on these do 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 banners when you have when you should have been saving ever since mail. So you should have like five thousand gems minimum. But you don't. It's fine. But you should have enough to do like one rotation. It's just like, it's just right. Um, <clears throat> the bond's very sexy. I know what panel this is from. Um, and all the melees on the banner. The, oh, they have the balance for here. Now the bond, what he does is, um, if I can like, uh, I have it in text form. Give me one second. I'm from Korean Jesus. Um, I'll get the, I'll get the the actual image. Um, what he does is he gives a uh, five percent attack HP related stats for every seventy cents hero, and um, when an animation has the concentration uh, concentration uh, mark, he will always crit on them. And remove the mark. Now, why is that good? Because uh, if we go back to um, the bond, right here, let me close all these things. All right, <clears throat> if we go to the bond, five percent HP related stats, uh, and when the um, when they're marked, he guarantees crit against against them. Now, the concentration mark itself inflicts them with minus one hundred percent crit chance, and the, he has the area of extortion. It's like AOE snatch. It's a it's a gray buff that he has, and when he uses a skill. When it, uh, seventy cents, I was just eating food. I'm sorry, and I just had to like throw everything away just to record this. When a seventy cents hero uses a skill, all enemies will get reduced attack rate sets by two percent, max five, right on each of them, and that's a bunch of debuffs, red debuffs. Okay, important. And all allies just receive twenty percent less damage. <clears throat> so like in, in the live stream, like the, the team wasn't taking any damage, and like you can already like the seventy cents team. I mean the one ultimate bond perg melee or like lost vein melee now, right? The best new unit in the game. Like, Lost Vein is better than this guy, by the way. He's better than any unit in the game, I promise. Um, I might just be, like, overreacting. I don't know. At 75 KCC, he infects, fills old gauge. He has increased card rates. Um, and cards, like, damage rates. Like, they upgrade the card damage, which is insane. Uh, sever. All stats increase. Crit defense increase. Attack related stats increase. Um, AoE, wipe. Uh, super effective against every type in the game. Like, you can't make a unit better than them. Anyway... <clears throat> His skill one, bond skill one, is snipe. That's his big, big skill. I, let's talk about skill two actually. Uh, his, his skill two is single target pierce, right? Like he w works with Roxy really well because he's he's double pierce, uh, a double single target with crit stuff. So like he's made for Roxy also, so you can like run and move Roxy. Um, single target pierce, and he applies the concentration mark for two turns uh, on rank three. 
Right, right. Oh, it's a skill one. Okay, that makes sense to talk about like this, yeah. Right, and it applies a concentration mark for uh, two turns. Now that in lowers the crit chance by 100%, and he's guaranteed to crit against someone his next card. And uh, his other card, Snipe, uh, <clears throat> has Snipe effect. <clears throat> and what it does is, it does 450% uh, his attack, whatever, right? who cares. It has double crit damage. So he's guaranteed to crit and has double crit damage. And remember all the debuffs he puts on enemies with like anyone attacking and stuff? He has 25% more damage per debuff to up to seven times. Right? Huge. Huge. 175% increased damage, double crit damage. He has really high crit damage. He had 240% in the, on the stream of uh, HP defense um, gear. Crazy. Uh, we didn't. Oh, we don't. We did see CC. CC was like 70.1k. Like, uh, like he's still like a tame unit, right? Like he's probably like top three in a game, but he's still tame in that regard. He's not like the lost vein. Um, banner is crazy. 0.25% uh, is going to hurt with all these units being here. Um, there's going to be the paid banner uh, where you get um, increased rates from one multi. It's stupid. It doesn't really do much. Um, <clears throat> Uh, but yeah, now we have Lost Vein, Lost Vein, LR Lost Vein, LR Lost Vein, LR Lost Vein. Also, 300 gems login, guys. It is so much to cover in these patch notes. We get 300 gems lo uh, login. LR Lost Vein, I might just make a whole separate video about him explaining it, because it's just it's just so much to talk about, right? He gets his card upgraded. I did make a video on that, so if you want to like know what the cards now do. like he has um, His single target now also has Sever, and it has a higher multiplier. His AoE also has Infect, and has a higher multiplier. Um, right, like you can see, like it goes from attack card to debuff card. It's because it's infect. And this passive upgrades from this like regular golden to the platinum diamond looking, uh, like ultimate skill effect looking uh, passive skill. Right. The other one, every time he gets ranked up, uh, every time he gets crit, he ranks up. And now also every time that happens, he gets atta increased attack rate stats and increased crit defense. So crits will not do damage to him, and he gets attack rates increased, and he ranks up his cards, and his cards get upgraded, and he's stupid now, and he has 75k to see. Did I mention that? Um, now, I would love to know uh, how you get these books. Um, yeah, you get new costumes as well. Uh, seven stars seven star can be obtained by exchanging materials. Oh, it's going to be in that funny mode too. Okay, and now we have the new mode, PvE Arena, um, Hero Arena, whatever. It's really cool. It's just Guild Boss, but it's not cringe. Um, <clears throat> so it's not really cool. It's going to be the same thing as Guild Boss, or like you're going to run the same thing. Uh, you're going to have to run like different teams. And um, in those different teams, you can all like have the same units multiple times, obviously. So you're gonna have to fill them out like differently. Kind of a real mode, obviously. If you've um, done Guild Wars before, you you could probably just like copy and paste the same teams, and it'll work out. Uh, because you know why wouldn't it? And then you get rewards based on your rank. Uh, so this is really cool. A new mode I can make videos on. Actually, like a genuine mode that's staying, like an actual mode that like is eight days left. Hmm, they might be like bi weekly, uh, bi monthly, monthly something bi weekly. I don't know. Um, we'll see, right? We don't know like the exact details, but with these coins, you can buy um, UR pendants, huge, two of them a week. Which is, uh, if you get, to, you can get, yeah, you can buy like the whole. I assume you can buy the whole shop up if you played enough. Um, you can buy two of them a week and a hundred of the the thing is here. Oh no, this is like a season. This is season. Yeah, you can get okay in the entire season. You can get these. That's not weekly, I imagine. Um, you can get twenty four of coins of these per week, right? So, or 28. Um, I don't know if it says it here. But you will face three enemies, okay, in the different leagues. Yeah, so I'm going to be in the highest league for sure. I'm going to actually, like, try on this mode. I'm going to, like, you know, I already have my, my account already set up for Guild Wars, so it, it'll be fine. We have Ban's outfits. He has a, the Warcore outfit, which looks really sick. And then we have the, like, um, Asian, like, Kung Fu mask, like, Nunchuck. That makes sense, right? Uh, outfit. And then we have the cringe one. Uh, Melly's just getting reruns. For his costumes that people might have missed because they're not day one players. New artifact set, which is um, basic HP related sets of like red humans, I think it is. And then we have the Holy Relic for Lost Veins per old gauge. They do 10% more damage, and every time she Diane uses the stance, all allies get 30% more damage for two turns. So that's pretty cool. And there's still a light on Dark Festival in the coin shop. Um, <clears throat> This is a dinosaur. This is this is for this is for me guys. This is not for you guys. This is also for me guys. Let me look at this real quick. <clears throat> okay, just okay. This is just regular stuff. This is like regular. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely buying this so I can get them up immediately and like quicker. Uh, full you are a full like rolled set. I assume like this is gonna be the the one with like the perfect basic stats you can pick. Um, this is gonna be pretty juicy. Three k yen. Yeah, it's like twenty four bucks. Uh, nice. Nice, very good. Um, oh, there's gonna be a Nidhogg. Oh, they're gonna do another Nidhogg pack, I see. 
obviously. And then Logan is going to be 300 gems, guys. Um, Logan is going to be 300 gems, and we're probably going to we're going to get a lot more from like different events and everything. Um, well, we're also gonna do it's so stacked. We got the, the hawk stuff. Remember, the, the this works the same way as on the one ultimate, the agree more event, right? Uh, you play, you get tickets, you do multis, and then eventually you get the units if you re reach like certain thresholds. You also get um ticket vouchers for your gear systems, which is really nice. And you get free level 90 UR of these, right? Of these like red, um, like seasonal characters. You get a Freya for free, the agree more for free, a Lilia for free, like all bunch of it. It's this stuff, right? You do a bunch of stuff, and then yeah, 1 out of 15 gets you the Hawk, and then so on and so forth, right? And you get a bunch of characters, a bunch of mats, godlike event, godlike event. We have a bingo event too, you know, huge. Um, these are the guaranteed rewards, right? So you get a Lilia, Grim, or Freyr, Hawk, right? Like the, the, the bottom ones right here. And then this level 90 ticket gets, gets you a red seasonal character. So one of these characters, I think, unless, yeah, one of these characters guaranteed too. Huge upgrade, huge, 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 huge. We have the, the funny shrine stuff, which is very good. Uh, you can farm a lot more demon mats that way. Um, Gallon's nephew returns, you know, they, they were thinking about me, of course, the goaded character. Um, special recipe. Oh, it's gonna be a different food. Um, they're gonna introduce new food. I think it's gonna be like a PVE food or something. Uh, yeah, a special that like once a day stage for 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 its ogres. Um Yeah. <clears throat> uh, oh yeah, the the tavern upgrade. Yeah, yeah, the 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 sex dungeon. Yes, sir. Um. Oh, okay. There's just there's a regular like stuff, right? There's like regular uh, anniversary stuff, lucky bag, regular stuff, um, and that's it. Obviously, we'll have a lot more to talk about when we actually have the mode in front of us, when we actually have the units, the, the you know the characters, the events, the rewards, when we see how it exactly works in game. But that's huge, guys. That's huge. This update, huge W. Grand Cross, the best gacha ever. Um, I love Grand Cross. I've never doubted them. Never doubted them. I always thought this was going to be the best thing ever. You can ask my friends. Never doubted them a single day in my life. Really excited for this mode. And I guess when you're max, you can like charge. Oh, no. Ooh, that's what that was. Oh, it shows you how much, how many you got a week, how much you charged up. Legend mark. I see, because uh, we were wondering on stream what that was. Uh, that's what that is. Okay, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm really excited. Um, I'm really excited. Again, 300 gems, bunch of free stuff. LR all lost awesome, Melitos. This banner is cracked. Actually, just so cracked. Like this banner, not a single unit here is like not usable. Like, you can use every unit here for something, right? The worst one would be, like, Halloween Roxy, and she's used for, like, PvE events, like, bad ones. Like, a gal nephew, right? Like, you'll one-shot him with her. Like, that type of stuff. That's what she's used for. You know, niche. But, like, everyone else here, like, Green Eastern, great backline. Blue Tarmel is still a good link for certain events. Um, she's obviously needed for, like, Belmoth and stuff. Um, Red Star will really good link still. Ludo, okay, he, he's like a fun unit more so. Green Mask, you can still run in PvP. I've, I've done it recently. She actually, like, I was like, no cap impressed. Uh, Green Mono, okay, she's okay. She's okay. She's like a fun unit. Then we have uh, Arthur. You still use him. Uh, still one of the only human supports we have. Which, by the way, there's a new Arthur, but I can't, like, really see it. But yeah, anyway, that's it from me, boys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Ciao. I'm excited. Uh, hit like, subscribe, donate money. Uh, Ciao.